I am thrilled to be here chatting with Justin from AcePack and this amazing, amazing industrial robot. One of the largest, I think, that we've seen here. Just to chat us through this Kawasaki um, that we're looking at. Yeah, so this is a Kawasaki. It's a 300 kilogram payload. Okay. So this particular unit's going to end up in a dairy. It's got quite a large gripper. We do um, partial pallet loads of it. So you don't do a whole layer, you just do part of a layer. But 300 kilogram lifting capacity and um, quite a substantial piece of kit. Let's just wander around to the front here. Um, so the role that, I guess, how this all hooks together, you've got the generic-ish Kawasaki arm, and then you guys uh, work with the, to, to make the excess of the gripper and, and integrate it all together. Yeah, so what ASPAC is, is we're an end-of-line specialist. So we manufacture the shrink wrapper that's standing in front of this. Uh -huh. That's one standing behind us over there. Um, we then build the gripper head, which is then custom built to whatever the requirement is. So this will take uh, six packs of milk, two litre milk jugs, bring them, pre-collate them, and then we'll pick up uh, something like 20 packs at a time, put them onto the, onto the pallet. And what's, uh, how fast is this going to be moving? You know, how up, well, you know, we talk about throughput with your, with your shrink wrapper bank yeah, there. So that's, this is running 60 packs a minute that are going into it. But because of the multiple movements that we put into and packs that we put into it, it's still running at about 10 movements a minute. Okay. Okay. It's fascinating stuff. And I was I was just saying to Justin before before we rolled, my first grown-up job was working with robots, with grippers and excessors on a much smaller scale than this in, in tape libraries in, in machine rooms a very, very long time ago. But I think they're still kicking around these days. Uh, different league now. Uh, speaking of different league, tell me tell me about where Acepack is based and the kind of clients that you operate with around the world. So Acepack is actually a South African company. Okay. Uh, we manufacture everything in Cape Town. Uh, we're also registered in the UK, so we're in Skelmersdale here. Yep. We deal in pretty much every industry. So whether you're looking in the, this is dairy industry, but we do everything from front doors through dynamite to parts for cars. Okay. Every conceivable edible product goes through a machine like this. You said dynamite there. Yeah, we do do, do, we do, do the dynamite fuses and that. We pack those. Okay, okay. <laughs> um, nothing's blown up yet. <laughs> but yes, we, 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 we do paint industry. We do um, chemicals, cosmetics, pharmaceutical. Um, everything that's made needs to be packed off in, in some way or other. So we, we deal with the dry end of it. So once it's in its bottle or in its box, we take over and take it from there, put it into shippers and, and out to market. You're here in the UK, um, tell, me how the, tell me how the market is for, for, for business, uh, for, for your equipment here, uh, up here. Well, we're finding it's quite a, quite a good market for us. Um, we've got a good footprint in the dairy industry, strangely enough, is, is sort of where we started into in the UK and that's grown quite substantially. Um, you know, the exchange rate is greatly in our favour, or in the UK's favour, so African rain performs quite poorly against the pound. So it makes the equipment, you know, good value by weight, good value by in, in, and without having to really discount the stuffing out of it or anything like that, you get a really nice piece of kit at a, at a good price. And um, you've been having good chats, good, good, good visitor footfall and, and fruitful conversations here at the show over the last few days? Yeah, we've had some really nice inquiries. Um, also, different industries, you know, sort of everything from fresh veg through crisps, through automotive products, um, pharmaceutical. So yeah, a, a nice a nice spread of, of clients this time. Good to hear. Uh, listen, Justin, thank you very much uh, for your time here on PPMA TV and I wish you all the very best for the rest of the show. Oh, thank you very much. Cheers. Cheers.